Hi everyone, I'm Alaya Jadi. Welcome to Music Greatness. This is Ruben, and for today's lesson, we have San Francisco Street by Sun Ray. And it sounds just like this. Alright, for this first part, we're going to take a look at the intro of the song. We're playing in the key of D major. And for this intro, our first chord is a chord voicing of D major 9. So that's a rootless voicing. So let's start with the left. I have four notes. F sharp, A, C sharp, and E. The major third, the fifth, major seven, and also the ninth. And for the right, four notes also. A, C sharp, F sharp, and A again on top. And playing this chord, I'm going to use this rolling effect on my right hand. So I'm going to play one note after the other, starting from the top. So this A, then play F sharp, C sharp, and finally A again, very, very quickly. And play my rootless voicing of D major 9. Next up. We're on to the 4 chord, G major 7, G, D and G for the left, that's B and F sharp for the right, major 3rd and major 7th, then we have E minor 9, now octave E on the left, G, B, D and F sharp for the right, Minor third, fifth, seventh, and ninth. So now we're on the two chord. We're going to go up on the five chord, playing A9, A and E, G and B for the right. And now we're gonna go back to D, playing D major 7. D, A, and D. That's for the left. F sharp and C sharp for the right. And we have a grace note on that D major 7. From B, going up on C sharp. Third finger, fourth finger. Okay, let's continue. We're going to replay G major 7, but this time one octave lower. And play it down here. G major 7, same voicing. G, D, and G. B and F sharp. Going down on E at 9. E minor at 9. Octave E. F sharp, G, and B. So we have the regular E minor, and we're going to add this F sharp, so the ninth, using the thumb on the right. And 
And after this E minor at 9, we have A13, two notes on the left, three notes for the right, A and G, B, D, and F sharp. So you can see it as a G major 7 over A, and that creates an A13 chord. Again, A and G, B, D, and F sharp. And coming at the end of the intro, we have two chords left. First, we have D major 9, D and A on the left. C sharp E and A for the right. That's D major 9. And then the last chord for this intro E minor 7, E and B, D, G, and A. So we have A on top, that's the 11th of E. So we have E minor 7 add 11. And that's all we're going to need for this intro. Let's quickly recap. We start on our rootless voicing of D major 9. With this rolling effect on the right. G major 7. E minor. E minor 9. Going up on A9. Then we have D major 7. Don't forget the grace note from B to C sharp. And now going down, we're going to replay G major 7. E minor at 9. A13, and now the last two chords for the intro, D major 9, and finally, E minor 7 add 11. Okay, now let's take a look at the playing pattern for this intro. We start on D major 9. Then we play G major 7, E minor 9, and before landing on A9 on the right, we're going to play E, then D, and finally land on A9. Okay, so play E minor 9, E, fourth finger, and then D, third finger, and play A9. Just like so. And just after A9, you have another melody line played on the right hand. This one. So that's three notes. You simply have to play A using your second finger, then B, third finger, going up on D using your pinky, and then play D major 7. Now on D major 7, before playing G major 7, play one A on your right hand and then land on G major 7, then play E minor at 9, and following that, A13, and at the end of this intro, you have a back and forth between D major 9 and E minor 
E minus 7, add 11. Okay, so play D major 9. Go up on E minor. We play D major 9. And then back on E minor. E minus 7, add 11. And we're going to end the intro on that chord. Let's count. Two, three, four. One, 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 two. Three, four. One, two, 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 three, four. And one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So mostly for this intro, we have one chord per measure, except for D major 9 and E minus 7 and 11. We're going to play those chords for two measures. One more time without counting. Two, three, four. That's for the intro. Let's recap. And that would be it for this first part. For the rest of the song, you can head over to musicgreatness.com. As always, guys, thank you for watching. If you love the content, leave a like, leave a comment, and also don't forget to subscribe. Until then, see you guys next week for another Euroband.